Welcome Rudy, so this is going to be a short tutorial on how to use a particular puppet script called Doc Revson for the Justit Radio Future characters. Now once you have your little scene set up, just go to add new animation model. And to easily find all of them for Jetset Radio Future related, just in the filter. JSR. And you can see every single one that I've done. So for this tutorial, I'm going to do everyone's favorite yo-yo. Now under the sequences, you can see that pretty much has nothing. And the animation version of him has everything there. So this little idol, I guess when you're talking to him. One's just standing around doing nothing. And then I guess a default idle, along with this character select dance. So you go ahead and put them both in to the scene. Alright, now it's now that you got both of them, go ahead and rename the source uh, you go ahead and rename the source where the animations are going to be coming from. So in this case, Yo-Yo. I'm going to go ahead and just name them... yo -y for now. And then for the target, which will be what you want to animate, same name, with the addition of underscore by one and now you go ahead right click rig and you find doc revson modified puppet you use the gamma one this is the best one that i found that actually sets everything correctly as you can see both of them just merge together under yo so when you go ahead and hide the puppet, now it's a normal yo-yo. Now you can go ahead to select root transform and set them up onto wherever you want them to dance or demonstrate. I'll just have them slightly above the stage there. And you go ahead, right click again, import sequence. Go ahead and choose whichever one you want to do. So we'll have him do his character select dance. And of course, as you can kind of see right away, he's facing the wrong way. That's an easy fix. Just select the root transform again, turn him around. And there we have it. See him do his little dance. Now the same thing can be applied to any of the Jetset Radio models, along with any other models that use the simple biped system. And that's just like how the naming convention of the bones are, so they'll just be just a bip spine zero, bip lower arm, that kind of thing. So the best example to do for now is we're going to have DJ K perform some of the dances. Just got to find him. There he is. Of course, he doesn't have anything. Right. He's in the scene. New model. And we're going to have him do... Let's see here... Um, we're gonna have them do Row Boys animations. So it'll be this one, RB animation. Actually, you know what? We'll have them do Rapid 99 instead. Go ahead and put her in. So, once again, name the source. 
Let's uh, call her Prof. And of course, rename him Prof underscore by one. Right click, rig, modify puppet gamma. And go ahead and hide her. And then go ahead and move them to wherever you want. Have them just. Whoop. Didn't want to go that far down. Just about there. Import sequence. Have me do that. Sucker transform again, turn him around so he's facing the camera. And I gotta move him up since I just saw his feet were in the ground. There we go. Oh, now he's just floating above the thing. Well, that's fine. Now he's doing the Rapid 99 dance. It's just that easy with that puppet to grip. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this quick little tutorial. The link to the puppet script will of course be in the description. Along with the final pack. And all the other characters in case you didn't get any of them. And have a good day Rudy's and enjoy.